Hello, YouTube friends. This is Tracy with CIRV. And right now, we are at Walmart. We're fixing to go do our little grocery shopping. I just got my teeth cleaned. Just left the dentist. See? I've got pretty teeth. They're squeaky clean now. And uh, we are at Wally World. So, we are going inside. Going to buy a few little things that I needed to pick up. And we'll see you in just a minute. Okay, hello YouTube friends. It's me again. I am back from Walmart with my grocery haul and I'm fixing to show you what I got. But I have to show I'm doing this a little bit backwards because I'm in a little bit of shell shock right now. Uh my grocery bill just plain old hurt my feelings at $112.19. Can you see that? OMG. Okay. I believe the biggest part of it was flea medicine for my dogs, but uh, we're going to go through this and uh, I, as soon as I, before I do my meal plan, I am going to find out exactly what costs so much. So here we go. Brett needed razors, Gillette Mach 3, that's what he asked for. He's going to have to get less expensive taste in razors, I can tell you that. Um, we got ibuprofen. For my headache that I'm probably fixing to take right now uh, we've got flea killer for my dogs uh, that is the 45 to 88 pounds and then Bella she's the big girl she needs the 89 to 132 pounds we have one dozen eggs a loaf of 35 calorie bread we got six of the Vienna sausages Brett likes to eat those while he's in the truck uh, then we got the brine potted meat, which is absolutely disgusting. I cannot stand it. I won't touch this. That is all he is. I promise. Uh, we got a pack of pop tarts. He likes the cherries. Uh, we got our, his planters mixed nuts, which I'll help him eat those. Uh, Dawn dishwashing liquid. I uh, got some lunch meat. I got the honey smoked turkey breast this time. Uh, Diet Coke, Dr. Pepper, and a Diet ginger ale. I've never seen Diet ginger ale before. I'm going to try that. A uh, bunch of bananas. Some candy out of the candy bin that they had. Milk duds, Swedish fish, junior mints. I got two things of raisinette, and that is an M&M. We got him some more of his favorite crackers that he likes to dip in the potted meat that is really gross and a big bag of shredded cheese I really should have bought more last week at Publix when they had it on sale for buy one get one free so for $112 that just don't look like much y'all so let me go figure out what I spent on what and uh, we'll do our meal plan coming up next Well, I was right. The majority of my bill was the flea medicine. And at $43.65, I'm not going to complain too much because it will treat both dogs for uh, three months each. So, I can't really complain about that. I love my baby, so and they're worth it. Uh, Non-food items were $15.86. And food items were $52.68, if you can call some of that food. Um, here we go. Let's get started on our meal plan. I've written down everything that I have in the fridge and the freezer. Let's go over this. We have two boxes of fish fillets. We have four pot pies, one frozen lasagna, two hot dogs, one package of pork chops, one and a half pounds of ground beef, probably... 10 or 15 chicken fingers left over from Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, two big bags of Rally's Fries. We will have Rally's Fries from now until Doomsday. Eight pieces of garlic bread. Two packages of meatballs. In the fridge, we have one onion, two cucumbers, 
about a quart of milk, mushrooms, a pint of those, 12 eggs, two packages, two 16 ounce packages of sour cream, uh, about a half a bag of salad, and we have that eight cups of cheese. In the pantry, we have hot dog buns, instant potatoes, green beans, sweet peas, diced tomatoes, uh, two cans of Rotel, a can of cream of celery, one cream of chicken, and two cans of spaghetti sauce. So, we're going to get started making our meal plan. Let's see if I can get you where you can see there. Okay. On Wednesday, that is today, and I am about to put on spaghetti and meatballs. Those frozen meatballs with garlic bread and a salad. Now that will get rid of one of my packages of meatballs, about four pieces of my garlic bread, and probably gonna finish off the salad. All right, Thursday. I really, really, really need to use up those hot dog buns before they get moldy and gross. And we won't eat them then. So we want to have hot dogs and chips tomorrow night. That'll be a nice, easy Thursday night dinner. So that will get rid of one of my packages of hot dogs. And... For, oh, and my buns. Where are they? Over here. Buns. Hot dog buns. Okay, Friday. I've got to use those mushrooms before they go bad. You guys know that I didn't have hot water in the RV for about three days last week, so I refused to cook during that, that time period because I couldn't clean up. So, um, I've got a lot of stuff left over that I was supposed to cook last week that I wasn't able to. So Friday, we're going to have hamburger steak with onions and mushrooms and gravy. And we'll put that mac and cheese that I was supposed to make last week and didn't. Wound up using all my cheese, though, on the sausage balls. They, they turned out really well. Macaroni and cheese, and we we're going to do instant potatoes, I believe, is what I had planned for last week. So we'll just move that on over this week. And that will get rid of my ground beef and the instant potatoes. We'll still have plenty of those left. And that will get rid of my mushrooms and my onion. And then Saturday. Saturday, I was planning on having barbecue pork chops last week with leftover macaroni and cheese. And that didn't get cooked, so it's going to get cooked this week. Barbecue pork chops, mac and cheese. And uh, I think we had green beans, so we'll use those uh, like we had planned. So that's going to mark off my green beans, my barbecue, my pork chops. And then Sunday is Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, y'all. I drew little hearts on there. Can you see them? Yay, happy Valentine's Day. Um, my sweetheart, the love of my life, is going to take me to our favorite little uh, steakhouse up in Coleman, Alabama. And that's where we're going to have our Valentine's dinner at. So, I will not be cooking on Sunday. Yay. Uh, Monday. I really don't like Monday. Monday is just a bad day. 
Um, pot pies sound good to me. Pot pies. And so that will take two of my pot pies. Leave me with two. And Tuesday, let's do those uh, fish sticks. Or fish fillets, actually. And we'll use some of those fries. And if I'm feeling super sweet and lovely, I might go pick up some slaw at Captain D's. <clears throat> Let's see. That'll get rid of one of my boxes of fish fillets. And I can't even mark off the fries because, like I said, we're going to have fries forever. So, let's look and see what we got here. Does it look like we're through? I think so. That looks good to me, folks. Um, I'm probably not, I don't have really anything that I, anything special to, recipe-wise, to show you this week. So, I will probably, um, I've already started working on a slideshow from last week. Because I didn't really have anything extra good to show you, um, so I will um, I'll include some of this week in that sh in that slideshow. I hope everybody has enjoyed my little meal plan and my little grocery haul, and I will see you next time on CRRV.